All right, so we back here once again. This time we're here to do a first reaction to this new D Skills Harris project entitled Westport and Beyond. Um, look, I'm gonna be honest. I don't really know much about this dude. I've, I've been trying to look up information on him and stuff. Only thing that I really know about him is that, if I'm not mistaken, he's a 20 year old rapper from the DMV area, Baltimore area. So a lot of people were commenting on the Bodie James and Jay Versace project, telling me like I need to get this guy. Listen. Um, I don't really know what to expect going into this. Um, seeing like people coming on the Bodie James project, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like on some rapidy rap type stuff. All right, so so without further ado, man, we finna get into it, man. D Skills, Harris, Westport, and Beyond. My first reaction. Let's go. So the first song we got on here is called High Science featuring Versatile K. Okay. I'm not they Okay. Okay, got the West Side gun ad libs. All right. <laughs> There's something very off about that first track, but at the same time, I don't know, bro. I just I feel like he probably did that jump for a reason. Uh, so yeah, the next song we got on here is called Sam Cassell. Okay. Okay. Mm. Man, this for me right now, I got like a question mark on it because this, it, it, this, this project, it got like a certain rawness to it right now. That is, I don't really know how to describe it right now. I'm pretty sure I'm going to come up with something. So yeah, the next song we got on here is called Baguette. Featuring Lil Web. Okay, so I'm pretty sure he put some type of auto tune effect this on on his voice. Um, I'm not feeling it right now. I feel like it'll sound better with him just on his on his regular junk, but I'm gonna let it continue. Guessing this Lil Web. D skills like his voice, like the voice manipulation thing he did. I wasn't really feeling that. And then I, I don't know. I just didn't really like the little web dude for this song. I feel like this is great production, but I feel like the vocals kind of like mess it up a little bit. So the next song we got on here is called Blackout, featuring Lil Web again. I'm not playing, bro. I'm not kidding. My father's just sleep with the fishes. For real, dog. Keep your distance. That boy like Biggie and Puffy Combs. Moving on, mm. I need another phone. Wherever I go, I'm home. Getting... I, I like the production, but he ain't really, I don't know. He ain't really giving me nothing special right now with these songs. Positions in every way. Baltimore City, the West, I claim. Made it to anthems like I have to eat every day. Take mm. up the ransom and make them pay. Might take the capital any day. This is weird because I actually like Lil Web on here more than I like D Skills, but okay. The next song we got on here is called 2014 Q featuring Lil Web again. What the fuck is going on right now? Bro, this is giving me like like Old ASAP vibes, like some like some live love ASAP type of shit right now. Like the production sound muffled and distorted a little bit, but he sound good flowing on it. We got blood song deck. 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 The next song we got on here is called What's Next featuring Shayla Rose. Okay, back to some boom bap shit. All right. This got like an old school vibe to it. The next song we got on here is called Sunday, featuring Versatile K and Mokla Michaelopedia. Hmm. 
Who got more soul than the sun with a hoe? Answer the questions and you already know. What? How I'm coming this year, the mic is my spin. Flow perfect like Kirk. Legend like Lux, no forgiving no work. Mm. I like how he sounds. Mm. I like this Michaelopedia dude. I think that was the Michaelopedia dude, bro. He, he went hard. Versatile K was nice too. Especially compared to what I first heard at the beginning. But yeah, bro. I'm yeah, I, I like that track. So the next song we got on here is called Cry Reactions and it's featuring Lil' Whip. I feel like Westside. <laughs> hey. Hey, this shit here is fire. Okay. Hey. I think what it is with Lil Webb, I think it's just his delivery. Like, his verse on here was great, but it's just like the way he sounds, like projecting his voice, it just don't resonate with me for real. But him as a rapper, he's he's dope. I like him. So next song we got on here is called NJLM featuring Lil Webb, Hayes, Michaelopedia, and Osha. Just like me, uh, I can't breathe. Part of my pattern of speech. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Hey. Okay, this is a little well. Hey. Hey. This might be the haze, dude. Where the faith in that? It's like, no, I'm Muslim. <laughs> and there's no mistake in that. Yo, but we still try to climb the equal ladder. It's the Michaelopedia dude. I like him. I'm trying to clean the world and stop the pollution. Hey. There's no law in order keeping y'all in order. Where the orange man on the stand for walls and borders. Oh, talk your shit, bro. Protect us. Bruh. This my Michaelopedia hard as fuck, bruh. I don't think he should have approached this beat with that type of sound. Like the way he sound right now, it's just I don't, it just counteracts like whatever this song is trying to pull off. I don't I don't like his delivery. Other than that, I like that entire song, for the most part. Then Michael Lopedia dude be going the fuck off. Like, he really do. So, the next song we got on here is called OMG. Oh, 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 oh my god, hey. I'm not getting mixed, but I break the rules. I'm a leader of men and they follow so. Hey, that's the final track we got on here is called Bret Hart featuring Mike Lopedia. Let's go. Say it with they chest. Ooh. Okay. Okay. What? 
12 sprayed my way. I've been waiting, having patience on the path of greatness. I've been to the hop as I get to the spot. When I spit off the top, came a long way from a kid off the block. Never gonna stop. Ooh. All the with all that. They know they not stopping me, right? Feeling like a boxer. You not dropping me, Mike. Pull up like Majin Buu with the Bobby D hype. Hey! Alright, so my final verdict for D Skill Harris is West Point and Beyond. This is a solid effort. This is a very solid effort. Now, a lot of people suggested this under the Bodie James video. So, that's what kind of gave me the mindset. Of like, okay, this might be on some rapidly rap shit. This dude got some rapidly rap elements. But at the same time, it's like he kind of trying to, like, put his own spin on it. Because it's like, we go from, like, the rapidly rap tracks to almost, like, on some trap shit. And it's like... Okay, he's showing like he got like some, you know what I'm saying? He got some versatility showing like, okay, I can get into my rapidly rap shit, but at the same time, I can give y'all some bangers too. I really feel like he's a good rapper. It's just, I don't know, I kind of feel like he need to find like a direction with it somewhat. Because I feel like they got, I feel like he got a sound. I feel like he got some type of sound, but at the same time, it's kind of all over the place a little bit. I feel like it need like a little bit more organization out of comparisons i was making while listening to this project it kind of gave me like a i don't know man i, I, I want to say like a beast coast type of feel because like i said bro he can he can switch between which bag he want to get in as far as like do you want to get on his rapidly rap somewhat conscious shit or do he want to get on like some banger like you know what i'm saying street shit like i feel like with this project right here he shows so much versatility and there's hella potential here. Also, the features on here. I respect the features. The features on here did they thing. The little web dude, I feel like with him, it's kind of like a... Sometimes I like him, sometimes I don't. With him, I feel like he one of them people, like he do be on his rapping shit, but at the same time, his delivery is what be throwing me off. Uh, Shayla Rose, I like what she did with her... Um, It was like a spoken word type of verse. It was cool. In, on the NJLM song, the Hayes dude, he sounded good. But the Osha dude, I, I'm just be honest. I just ain't like his delivery. I feel like, I don't know. They could have just, that song could have just ended with Michaelopedia and I would have been straight. We're speaking of Michaelopedia. Michaelopedia is, is my favorite feature on this mug. Legit, every verse on here, he killed and he had like some fire ass shit to say. Versatile K, I'm gonna be honest, on the first song, he kind of threw me off with the way he was rapping or whatever, but he really did catch my attention on the song Sunday. And I ain't even gonna lie, she he might she might have the best verse on that damn song. Like, I just I just like the versatility, man. Dude showing like he, there, there's potential here. There's potential here and I don't know how old he is, but from, I don't know, based on what I'm listening to, he sound like he like, sound like he like late teens or early 20s somewhere. I wouldn't be surprised if he was like 19 years old or some shit like that. But yeah, man, keep doing what you're doing. Keep pushing. Um, Shout out to the people that recommended me this. Like, yeah, I probably would have never found this. So, man, thank y'all for that. If I had to choose my favorite songs off this project, it'll probably be Sam Cassell. 2014Q, Sunday, NJLM, and Bret Hart. So yeah, let me know how y'all feeling about this project in the comment section. Let me know if I was wrong about some stuff. Please feel free to correct me. Also, please be sure to leave suggestions as far as like different songs, artists, up and coming folks that you guys think that I should listen to. If you guys don't leave in the suggestion below, you can also DM me at the social media app right here. My DMs are open. Feel free. So yeah, man, it's T Sign now once again. Remember, before the end of the year, we trying to get ten thousand subscribers, man. We trying to do this shit. So yeah, this is T Sign now once again. Thank you guys for watching this video. Peace.